play is about being asleep and being awake. Um, it's about fear. Man, woman. Parenthood. It's really about the psychic and emotional stress of living in the cusp of the apocalypse, which is sort of where we are. One of the jobs that the theater has is to explore dangerous things in a very safe environment and with a community of people sharing that, uh, that experience. It's really um, a very naturalistic, realistic confrontation with um, the reality that we're living in a very, very stressful end time situation. And it does it in a way that I think is human and charming and uh, like you said, naturalistic. So it isn't just a shock theater thing about end times and you know, you should be absolutely terrified. You watch these two people uh, dealing with it. Well, I, you know, I'm thrilled, it's great. I and mean, what can I say? It's, you know, this is my first thing, my deepest thing, my place where I'm most comfortable. She sent me a play which, in the early days of the flea, was probably one of my favorite, favorite productions called The Light Outside. And it was um, really a, powerful, beautiful piece of writing. We had a great, great time doing The Light Outside. That's a really scary play, and um, I, no, and really, I think, actually, no one else in the world has been up for doing that play. They're and out of their minds. It's a great play. Part of what we do at The Flea is both get people going at the beginning of their thing, particularly if they have a, an interesting voice and they have talent, but also, on the other side, on the flip side, while they're out running, you know, having great careers, um, if they want to come back into the our little ball, ball pond, pond <laughs> and play, uh, we are so eager to have them. The Flea has, you know, matured so much and become such an important institution in New York theater, so vital. And in fact, I've heard from people, as I've said, I have a play going up at the Flea, people saying like, oh, wow, that's like the only place that does anything that interests me anymore, that feels contemporary and that's exciting. My job is really to um, really let this play breathe and exist. But when I think about um, people coming in to see it and what the, how they're gonna react, I don't know. And I think that's interesting.